In today's video, we'll guide you through the process of depositing cryptocurrency into your Cropty wallet. Whether you're a seasoned crypto investor or just getting started, we've got you covered. Let's dive right in. The first step in depositing crypto to your Cropty wallet is obtaining your wallet address. There are three ways to do this. Let's explore each one. Option one is by using the Receive button in your Cropty wallet. Simply open the app, navigate to the wallet you want to deposit funds into, click on its name, and tap on the Receive button. You'll see a unique wallet address generated specifically for that wallet. Option two is through a nickname. If you've assigned a nickname to your wallet, you can share this nickname with others who want to send you cryptocurrency. They can enter the nickname into their Cropty wallet to initiate the transfer. You can assign a nickname and create a public link in settings. Lastly, option three involves using a public page by nickname. You can create a public page with a specific nickname by opening settings and clicking on the pencil icon next to your public link. Anyone who visits this page that you created can send you cryptocurrency using your wallet address. Once you have your Cropty wallet address, the next crucial step is selecting the appropriate network for your deposit. Choosing the right network ensures the successful transfer of your funds. Make sure the selected network matches the platform you are withdrawing from and depositing to. Once you click on the network you prefer, your wallet address will automatically update. Copy this address and insert it into the corresponding field on the platform you are depositing funds from. When depositing to Cropty Wallet from other crypto platforms, use a relevant withdrawal guide tailored specifically to that platform. The available networks in Cropty Wallet include Bitcoin, BTC, Tron, TRC20, Ethereum, ERC20, Binance Smart Chain, BP20, and Polygon POAS Chain, ERC20. Each network corresponds to a different blockchain or cryptocurrency ecosystem. It is also very important to note that your wallet has a different address for each network. This means that if you switch between networks, you will be provided with a distinct wallet address for each one. For instance, if you have a wallet on the Ethereum network, ERC20, and you decide to switch to the Binance Smart Chain, BP20, network, you will be assigned a new wallet address specific to the BP20 network. The same applies when moving between other networks. When picking networks, remember these factors. For fast, cost-effective transfers, go with Binance Smart Chain or Tron, while Ethereum is best for decentralization and added security. Before proceeding with the transfer, take a moment to double-check the accuracy of the address and network information. Ensure that the wallet address you are sending your cryptocurrency to is correct and matches the intended destination. Additionally, confirm that you have chosen the appropriate network. By meticulously reviewing the address and network details, you can mitigate the risk of sending your funds to the wrong destination, ensuring a secure transfer. Once you have verified the accuracy of the address and network, you can proceed with the cryptocurrency transfer. If everything is in order, initiate the transfer from your external wallet or exchange platform to your Cropty wallet. If you're transferring crypto via Cropty, use your nickname. The transfer is instant and doesn't incur any fees. This convenient feature allows for hassle-free and immediate transactions between Cropty users. That's it for today's video on depositing cryptocurrency to your Cropty wallet. Remember, double-check all the details before making any transfers to ensure the safety of your funds. If you have any further questions or need assistance, feel free to reach out to our support team. Thanks for watching and happy crypto trading.